What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Lorna Marie. Today for you I'm bringing you my restaurant bag, entertainment bag, whatever you want to call it. It's the bag that has all of your tricks that you have on the go to keep your kids entertained, your little monsters, whatever you want to call them. Oh, today they're little monsters. Okay, they are in rare form, but I like to think of this bag as this is my Mary Poppins bag. This is where I pull out, like I said, my bag of tricks so I can be entertaining my kids while enjoying my life because we know those can be really hard to do at the same time. You know, let's just say it. Let's just put it out there. <laughs> so anyways, I don't know what lockdown rules are where you're at, but we're in Florida so we can pretty much go anywhere, do anything as long as we uh, wear a mask and um, abide by the rules, wash your hands, all that good stuff. So obviously abide by the rules where you're at. If you're not going out anywhere, use this video as a tool for the future. If you guys are starting to go out, things are starting to reopen, definitely consider bringing this bag with you so you can be prepared. And you know, one of those moms that just come to the rescue for your girls, you're like, girl, just wait. Ta-da! You pull it out and they're just like, oh, you are a savior. I love those moments. That's why I like these channels because I do a lot of kids here. So if you are into kids or organization, this is the channel for you. Look no further. Subscribe. Hit that little bell so you're notified. I'm currently traveling in an RV. That's why I am in such a small room um, with my family of six. We are traveling around. We are in Florida right now. We've been all over the place. So if you're interested in that, stay tuned for that as well. I'm going to list all the products down below for you guys where we get things I will mention things during the video as well so you guys can get a real idea of how to put this entertainment bag together for yourself and what are some really vital things that I like to have in there to make this bag feel complete if you feel like depositing some positive energies give your girl a thumbs up I would so appreciate it come down and say hi in the comments I love getting to know you guys even just one little emoji means the world to me also come get to know me on Instagram I post things that I don't necessarily post over here so definitely come check me out so without further ado if you guys want to see what's inside my restaurant entertainment bag then just keep watching all right you guys let's hop into this video I am currently in my living room right now I'm in an RV, a full-time RV. I think I mentioned that in the in the intro. But we got some stools here, so I thought this would be the easiest place for me to film today. It's a little bright here, so hopefully that's all good. Anyways, look at these bags! Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. So this video is basically a two-part system. I like to develop systems to make my life easier. Honestly, always adapt for yourself and your family and your needs. Obviously, I have four kids. That's why I have four bags. And then I have this here. Um, use a smaller bag. Use what you have. Whatever works for you guys, I'm here to support you and just give you ideas. Now, if there's too much in my bag, put less. I don't have enough in here. Hey, you can always add more. So that's the beauty about watching videos is customize it for yourself. There are no rules. That is the beauty. All right, but the one thing that I'm so excited about is these bags. Like you guys, do you see this? I have black for the boys and pink for the girls. Everybody has their own initial. And then I had play put on this one. So I did customize this one as well. You guys will be able to purchase these bags. I'll have the link down below for you guys for each of these because I, I can't even believe it. I have so many more bag videos coming because I'm obsessed with this company and the things you can do because you guys know I like to label but look embroidery okay let's do it like the most elegant label you can get your hands on right so with this system I have four of these little bags these are individual one little set for each of my children and then I have a giant bag here so this is a two-part system okay what that means is I don't ever bring these bags together they are always separate and I always get questions about that like when do you bring each bag so I'm gonna break that down for you here today this bag is all kinds of amazing okay there's this side here I'm gonna show you everything that's in it and then it has another side over here okay now this bag is for everyone we all share the contents inside this bag and we can be bringing this to the park um, with friends this could be I know we're going to a restaurant that's going to take a little bit longer also if we're going with friends to a restaurant I probably won't bring their individual ones I don't want anybody to feel bad or left out 
um, I'm not trying to make people's parents feel bad. Um, I probably, I probably would bring this and then that way we can all share. We can share with our friends. Um, this is more for when we go on our own. So if we go to a restaurant or, I mean, honestly, I could just feel like switching it up. I don't want to carry the big bag. Just where it just depends on where you're going. I would definitely bring this for like a day trip. Like if we're, I know we're going to be going to like a street fair and all these things and I know we're going to end up at a restaurant, I would definitely bring these. They're great to help my kids wind down after they've been walking around. It keeps their mind stimulated while I can enjoy my lunch or my dinner or whatever it is and enjoy my time. We'll go through those in just a second. We're going to go through this mama jamma first. On the front here it says play. I just thought that would be fun. I wanted it to be black just in case um, you know it gets dirty. So I love that it's black and it says play on the outside. The straps are are super heavy duty and there's so much organization going on here which I love this basically has so many different games and art and things to keep your kids entertained on the go it has a snap closure it has a pocket with velcro here and it also has this little mesh pocket which is for thinner things so in this first pocket here I have my four little chalkboards. I thought this would be fun when we go out to like the park or something and they want to like sketch something with chalk and I feel like chalk is very sensory so I thought that would be great in here. I also have two little tape dispensers because kids love taping things. They can tape, if we're at the park, they can tape leaves or flowers to their notebooks. That would be really fun. Then in this section here, I have a bunch of stickers and tattoos. Let me just pull them out so you can see some varieties. 99% of the stuff in all of these bags are from the Dollar Tree. So if you guys have not seen my Dollar Tree hauls, definitely watch out for those because you'll be able to see some great ideas. Super affordable, literally everything, but maybe like one thing, two things is not from the Dollar Tree. So these stickers, everything, Dollar Tree, there's all kinds of little fun stickers in here. But this is what I found. I found some tattoos. I thought this would be so much fun at the park with our friends or whatever. We got these ones, cute, right? So I got four different ones, two boy and two girl. I don't know about you guys, but I love seeing people put things back where they go when I'm watching videos. Is that so weird of me? I don't know, that's the organization person inside of me. Okay, so then they have these little snap closures right here. They snap so nicely, so strong. And then let's move on to this outer pocket here. So this has some great organization. It has a clear zipper pouch here and three pockets here, which you can fit a really good amount inside. Also with a snap closure on this side. So this is from the Target dollar spot. I just put a little puzzle in here. My daughter can do outside. Like honestly, it's so great too. Like even for the RV, I can just grab this and we can go sit out front, this whole bag. Then we have some of these square papers, which they can do whatever we, they want. But I got these for origami. My kids love doing origami. Okay, then on this side, we have some glue. All of this stuff is Dollar Tree, except for that. So then, this is some Crayola glue I thought they could use in their notebooks. Then we have some pencils. I got boy colors, I got girl colors, and then I got this crayon. It's got all the different colors you can like change the top colors. And then I have four little pairs of safety scissors, kid scissors in there. So next up we're gonna go on top. Now just sitting on top here, I'm gonna say actually everything from here except for these markers and this is all from the Dollar Tree, everything everything inside the containers, everything. This container, I just stuck a bunch of little chalk in here and they can pull it out, do chalk. Then I have some frozen playing cards. My son has regular ones in his little bag, but I thought these would be fun in here for the kids. They're jumbo, I don't know if you can see that. Okay, so then now that kind of exposes the organization that I have here. I have four of these little containers, two of these larger ones, and on the left here, I'll pull them out in a second, but on the left here, I have a little set of markers. I got these from Ross. They're just brush pens, which I thought these would be so great for notebooks and um, doing like nature-y stuff. This little zipper pouch is from Target. I've shown this in a Target haul before. And then I stuck a Dollar Tree checkers game inside of here, which is really nice and compact. Then I put some wet wipes in here if we're doing whatever and we need to wipe our hands off, chalk or whatever. Let's go to this side first. So I have four little containers. 
We have one for each kid. I have two boys and two girls, if you guys don't know that. And what I did is I just put one little tiny, I'll open one of these up for you. I put one little tiny Play-Doh, and then I put a couple of these little guys from the Dollar Tree, they're little bugs and lizards and things like that and I stuck them in here so they can play with them now I have a 12 year old so he's almost 13 but honestly he still likes playing with stuff like this I mean I would too um, it's just fun keeps your mind occupied so we have those in there now this is how I kind of divide all of the art supplies up okay since I have two boys and two girls my kids I always divide my kids up into partners my son always helps my younger son and my daughter always helps my younger daughter and I have two boxes that way the boys can use one and the girls can use one on either side of the table that way there's no fighting too much reaching over it just makes it easier if you don't want to do that you don't have to obviously if you don't have four kids you definitely don't have to but I just like doing that it makes my life so much easier all right then on this left side here I have two bottles of bubbles I stick the bubbles there that way Nick can do one I can do one or um, each big kid can do one for the little kids. So I thought having two would be nice. Then I have these books. These are also from the Target dollar spot. They were $3. They're just blank books. And we're going to be doing like some nature stuff in here. And I thought it would be great to go outside and get inspired to write. Um, so I got some of those. Now everything else, all these coloring books are from the Dollar Tree. I'm going to go through these really quickly and show you which ones we have. Just so you guys can get a good idea on what's there and what you guys can find. All right, so we have an Avengers coloring book, and we have this tropical party, which I thought was super cute. Then we have sparkly unicorns, which is really adorable. And then we have jumbo Batman coloring. I got try to get two boy and two girl ones, and then I got three of these like more mature ones. The, these are smaller, harder to color. I'm actually really want to do one of those. Did you guys used to love those? I used to love the felt posters. Those were my favorite. Did anybody else like those? Comment down below if you guys like those. So we got those. I think my son can do either one of these. And then this is the last one. It's like cool, right? Okay, I'm going to put everything back the way I found it. And for me, I always like doing things like a file folder system. It just makes my life easier. I know what I'm looking for. I know how I like to organize things. All right, then we're going to just stuff all of our other things back in here. These go on the top here. All right, and then these last two things go there. So that is the play kit. And I just love that I can just say that to the kids. Go grab the play kit and let's play, baby. <laughs> like I said, each kid has their own kit. It has a top handle and it has a zipper that zips all the way around, which is so nice. Now, if you can see that, it is not super thick. I like that it's skinnier. You guys, these would be great for traveling, putting your toiletries in. You could do so many things with these bags, even this bag. I was like, what else could I do? hair stuff um oh man just know i got a lot of kits coming in the future and definitely some organization some house stuff coming up soon too but i'm just so excited about these bags all right let's want to open one of these bad boys up so i can show you what we have going on here when you first open it you will see everything is all organized and so fun in here we have a clear zipper pouch at the top here which I've stuck some things in. I'm gonna go over everything with you. Then, I don't know if you guys can see this, but this is actually another clear pouch with a zipper at the top, which you can put flat things in the front here, which is great. Also, it has an, another two compartments, which I haven't stuck anything in there because I wanted to stick it up front so you guys could see it, but it has another two little mesh compartments back here, which you guys, that is so great. And like I said, it's not too thick where it's going to take up too much space, but it's amazing. Okay. And then it has this hanging strap here. You can unbuckle this. So if it needs to go around something super accessible. So I just pulled everything out of this little section here. Everything in the, inside this bag is from the Dollar Tree, which is awesome. So if you're looking for any of it like this this was from valentine's day so you probably won't be able to find it it's just a little thing of putty but pick things up like this you guys and store them in like a big tote if you have space i have an rv so it's a little harder for me 
but I still find a way to like store things so I can use them as little entertainment items. And I can update this, you guys, as I, you know, change it off. You guys want to see what I'm doing. I'll keep showing you. And then too, when I switch out the bag, I'll show you guys that as well. So this little fun pen, it's got all the different colors. Um, you know, I think this is from Walmart, now that I remember. It's a little crayon that you, I remember these when I was a kid. You can keep putting these towards the top and change the colors, which is fun. Then we have just one little pencil here. And then I got all the kids a different color. So this is just like a stationary pouch. There's cards and there's envelopes. But I'm also sticking all of their little stickers in here. I cut some little spaceship stickers and stuck some of these little puppy ones in here for them. All right, and that is all that is in this top section here. Okay, the zippers are so nice on these, you guys. All right, let's move this up here. So like I said, there's a zipper pouch right here. I'm gonna go through that first and then show you all the things that I have inside. Now, when we go to a restaurant, I usually just have my kids get water. I don't want to pay extra. That's just kind of where we're at right now. I honestly only order water now too. My husband will occasionally get like a Diet Coke, but I just don't. I want to save money and I feel like if we want to get soda, we can get like a big thing of soda, like a two liter for the same price. So anyways, I stuck these in there, which I thought would be fun for them. So we got two new flavors here, which I never saw before. Cherry 7-Up and then there's Blue Raspberry. They're definitely not the healthiest. I know they're probably full of things that I don't want my kids to have, but if we're out eating already, they're already getting things they're not supposed to have. So this is just a great way to save money and give them a special little treat when you're out. Want to keep them a little entertained. And the best part is I can put a half a pack in each big glass of water instead of like the whole pack like they say. That will last them the whole time we're at the table, one little packet, which is awesome. So I just stick two of those in here just for fun. They're so excited when they saw this. They're like, oh my gosh, I can't wait to use that. Then I stuck these. These are in the learning section at the dollar store. They're just some little stencils. So I thought that would be fun for them to do. And they're flat, so I stuck them in the front here. Okay. Now then, let's go to this right side. They come in a set of two. This was for Easter, so they'll probably still have these. This is just a little bit of that like foam stuff. And I cut them down so they would fit in here a little bit better. But even who cares if it's Easter and you give that to, him, to them in like summertime. Having stuff for 50 cents that the kids can play with inside their little bags is so nice. You know, this is super affordable. Okay, so then I've shown you guys this. This is a little dough kit. It comes with a bunch of little cutouts and some dough inside. And then I'll just replace it with another one of those little smaller Play-Dohs, like the real brand, um, once this dries out. Because I don't know if it will you know, stay sealed like this. But I thought that was such a great little kit. It's like one kit and be done kind of thing, which is nice. Ha has all you need in there. Then these straws are also from the Dollar Tree. Each kid has their own straw. Sometimes they give you paper straws, which is like, ugh, I, I cannot stand a paper straw, you guys. It is like the worst thing ever. So these are super cool. And you guys can repurpose the containers for things. You guys have seen me do that. Love that. So I showed you guys these in my Dollar Tree haul and I told you I was going to put them in their lunches and stuff like that. And how cute are these, you guys? They are so cute. So the boys have blue. Let me pull his out. So the boys have blue and the girls have pink. Okay, what I'm doing in here is I stuck two little Snickers in here and I have like a little container of candy that I will keep refilling this every time we go to a restaurant when I remember. They already know I said it's only special occasions and certain times of when I, it's actually when I can remember. I will refill with a little piece of candy when I don't feel like buying them dessert. You know, they always want dessert and I'm like, look, you can open your little thing now and they will love it. And if me and Nick are still finishing our food, cause you know, kids always eat their food a lot faster. This will buy us some time. It's just a fun little thing too. I love that my kids can have stuff like this. It just makes things special, you know? So inside here, I have these two last things. This is an activity pad, which is so cool, you guys. It has all kinds of different colors. It's got white in here and every color you can think of that they can do activities with. And I know my kids are going to love this at the restaurant because sometimes when they're coloring on the paper, they give them, my son's like, I need another one. I need another one. So this is going to be perfect. Okay. Then these little waffle block sets were a dollar from the dollar spot at Target. That's another thing that's not from the dollar store. The container was from the Dollar Tree. 
and I remember these when I was a kid, you guys. They used to have giant ones at, like, my daycare. Oh, my gosh. These are so fun. So, they put them together and build puzzles. And then I got the boys a different color. So, they have, like, the darker set. And the girls have the neon ones. Aren't those so fun, though? I love them. They're so excited. Oh, and so, I, if you're wondering why the container is so big for this, it's so they can actually play with it in here. I don't want them to pull it out onto the table. That will be a rule. Like, you have to play or build inside of here. And it's big enough. Let me show you. So that they can do that inside the tray. The only thing that my son has different is I put some playing cards in here for him. He just, and um, his has a little bunny. That's what actually the set was like that um, in his. And then he has like different colors of things, but everything else is the same. And so now I'm gonna stick that there. I'm, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm probably gonna stick the um, straw back here. I'll put this little guy up here and then I'll probably stick this guy in here in the back right there so it stays a little more organized these are 31 bags i love them so so much you guys they are amazing i will link like i said them down below and if you want them initialed i think it's like a flat six dollars for everything which is so worth it you just you're not customizing things like this you know what i mean it's not that accessible and if you guys want to earn free product you can throw a party if you guys want an extra income you guys can always join my team and yeah i mean this just fits me i know there's a lot of stuff out there that people use and do and i'm sure they love it but this is more my style. Like I love bags, I love containers, and you know, it's me. <laughs> so if you guys have any questions, comment down below. And yeah, these are the beautiful bags that I'm so excited for you guys to get your hands on. You guys, I hope you enjoyed my restaurant entertainment bag, whatever you wanna call it. I had so much fun putting this together for you. I really hope I added value to you today. And if I did, definitely consider sharing this with your friends and family. And also one of the ways you can really benefit me is watching my video all the way through without skipping. Now I wanna see only leave me the sun emoji if you did not skip anything this time. I always say if you make it to the end of the video, but I want to see who did not skip anything. Leave me that sun emoji and let me know that you're a ride or die. I appreciate you so much. You guys, you have no idea. It really, really helps my channel. I know you guys could be anywhere else, but you chose to be here with me. So if you haven't subscribed already, subscribe, hit that little bell. Come say hi in the comments. Thank you guys again so much for watching. And until next time, I'm always your girl, Lorna Marie. Bye. Wish I could say I was finally over you But that's not the truth mm -mm. Everyone always keep falling in the